हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टूडे वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द लाइफ साइकिल ऑफ प्लाज्मोडियम दिस इज द लाइफ साइकिल ऑफ प्लाज्मोडियम बाय बैक्स प्लाज्मोडियम प्लाज्मोडियम इज अ पैरासाइट व्हिच इज अ पॉजिटिव एजेंट ऑफ मलेरिया टू व्हेन अ फीमेल फीमेल एनोफिल मॉस्किटो बाइट्स अ ह्यूमन देन इट्स इंटर्स द स्पोरोजाइट्स ऑफ प्लाज्मोडियम into the blood stream of human here plasmodium anopheles mosquito is a vector when this sporodes enters into human body it goes into liver when this sporogyte enters in liver cell which is also known as hepatic cell then it converts this structure and it changes in a rounded cell structure now this is known as cygon now the nucleus of cygon divide multi fly asexually and its nucleus take cytoplasm of form and form a new cell this new cell is known as cryptozoite or cryptomerozoite when this cryptomerozoite enters into another liver cell then it's again divide asexually or reproduce asexually and then its nucleus multiply divide and take cytoplasm a form and form a new type of cell this new type of cell is known as metacryptomerozoite this metacryptomerozoite can be of two types first macro beta crypto mirotrix which is large in size and second is micro beta crypto mirotrix which is smaller than in comparison of macro beta crypto mirotrix now this make macro beta crypto mirotrix in turn into another liver cell and this cycle again takes this this process repeat again and again and micro beta crypto mirotrix enter enter into red blood cell when it enters into red blood cell then this structure is known as trophozoite now trophozoite changes its genes its structure and form a vacuole a big size vacuole in this structure when a big cell vacuoles form then this nucleus push periphery when its nucleus push periphery then it looks like a ring this is known as signet ring structure now after after formation of signet signet ring state now changes takes place in this structure and it changes into a amoeba like structure this stage is known as amoeboid stage now this amoeboid structure changes again and it's formed a spherical or rounded structure which is which is known as cygon now the nucleus of a cygon divide or multiply asexually and there is a formation of many nucleus now this nucleus nucleus takes the cytoplasm of form uh, and form a new type of cell which is known as merozoite when merozoite increase in number in red blood cell then it creates a pressure on the wall of rbc and the wall of rbc is ruptured when the wall of rbc is ruptured then this merozoite enters into blood some merozoites attack attack again and again rbc and this cycle takes place and some merozoites enter into rbc and form macrogametocytes and microgametocytes now here formation of macrogametocytes and microgametocytes takes place when a female anopheles mosquito takes a food bee from a infected human then 
this gametocyte in turn into the gut of mosquito. Then these gametocytes in turn into the gut of mosquito. Then micro gametocyte change its structure and form a funnel like structure which is known as fertilization tube. And micro gametocyte divide again and again. Now the nucleus of micro gametocyte divide and form a flagellar like structure. This process is, is this process is known as X flagellation. Now the spore and O and macrogametes fuses. When spores and macrogametes fuse, then then formation of zygote takes place. This zygote is immotile. After certain time, changes in the in the structure of zygote takes place, and it changes its structure and form a motile form structure, which is known as oocyte. Uukinite is motile state. Now, this uukinite is motile, so it moves into it moves into the stomach wall of female Anopheles mosquito. When it enters in the stomach wall of female Anopheles mosquito, then after some time, it changes its structure. When it changes its structure, then it forms a cyst. Which cyst is called as oo cyst. Now the division of nucleus takes place in oo suit cysts and formation of sporozoids takes place. When sporozoids form in the last number, then it creates on the pressure on its wall. That is wall structure and sporozoids released in mosquito. Then if if these sporozoids enters into the salivary gland of female Anopheles mosquito. When the female Anopheles mosquito, which is infected of, for this of this plasmodium, in which the infection of this plasmodium takes place, when this Anopheles mosquito bites a healthy person, then again it injects its sporozoid with saliva during food break. And sporozoids enters into human body, and this cycle takes place again and again. Now, we can see sexual stage of its life cycle takes place in the gut of mosquito, and asexual cycle takes place in human. So, because the sexual cycle of plasmodium takes place in mosquito, so mosquito is called as primary host and asexual cycle takes place in man so man is called secondary host this is the life cycle of plasmodium in the life cycle of plasmodium cytogony takes place three times first time when first time when first time sporozoids enter into hepatic cell or liver cell then cytogen formation takes place and this Nucleus of this cytogen divide and form cryptozoids. First time asexual reproduction takes place in the liver cell, known as pre erythrocytic cytogony. So, when this multiple division or asexual reproduction takes place next liver cell, then this is known as exo erythrocytic cytogony. And third time, this cytogony takes place in the Red blood cell. This is known as erythrocytic cytogony. So, the life cycle of plasmodium uh, by is continued in this form.